Welcome back everyone, this is J7Js bringing you the rare battles in chapters 2 and 3 on Valley of Swale. And for this first one, you want to go from the gallows or the execution site. And you can encounter some female knights. Which means, you know, you can get some much better swords earlier on um, if you want. And you can also see the uh, tier 3 of the goblin. So yeah, just be careful. They're going to be a bit harder. But in like a lot of these monster battles, just having Blade Grasp or Shida Hadori, um, you should be fine. Or if you have like a person with a ranged, like and you know, an archer, black mage, or use, you know, holy sword from Agrius, you're gonna be okay. Like they're not that mobile for the most part, like the goblins, the knight. The cat can't enter water, so like you should be fine in most cases. But yeah, just be careful when they come up to you. And there's a stone from the knight. Um, she's a female cancer in my Rob's Capricorn, so they have best compatibility. And there you go, Rune Blade. And this was done in chapter three, but you know, you can also get some pretty strong equipment. And 481 with that ice brand. And here's a hollow bolt. Doing 200 apiece, man. Very good damage. Probably, in my opinion, it's the most overpowered ability in the game because it's, you know, ranged. It hits hard. So, that's, that's my opinion. But if not, no worries. So here's a cat scratch. Looks more like a kick, like, I, I don't know. <laughs> Definitely not a cat slap, um, in my opinion. So this Penelope just throwing rocks, man. Um, epic soulbind for nine. Like, it's, yeah, she's not gonna be too threatening uh, as long as, um, there's 240 from Ramza. Yeah, I mean, not too threatening as long as she doesn't come up and you know, melee us. So this Divine Ruination will take care of this cat. So more PA, I believe, than the Red Panther, but less HP. So there's the trade-off. And in my opinion, that cat has nice, nicer uh, color fur, even though I'm allergic to cats. So not really a cat person. So, Ursula is that knight's name. Just, yeah, Shida Hadori, man. Can't do anything. For the most part. And Judgment Blade finish, finishes off Ursula. Now, in Chapter 4, um, this is where you can uh, see Tiamat's. So, please check that out. Like, I have a playlist of the special very rare battles in chapter four and those are a lot cooler these are just being uploaded for um you know if you're if you want to see like just for um like myself and anyone who wants to see it and like even though i feel like builds etc in chapter four like People want to see the final stuff uh, more often than not. Like when I played, uh, I used to be a big World of Warcraft player. Like if people want to see the builds and etc, they see what's like the best in slot, like the maximum end game stuff. Like they'll, people will rarely ever have like earlier um setups and builds so that was kind of the inspiration for the builds like just to show off and oh man that goblin is running away because he's in critical um let's see if ramza can finish off wow 585 38 percent chance to land and he gets it so usually not with my rng 
But um, here's a judgment blade to finish off this uh, gobble the gook, the uh, tier 3 goblin for 190 and that's a wrap. So for this one, um, just go from the gallows if you really want to get a better sword than the ones at the uh, shop at this point. Like, um, I'm definitely gonna do something like that for a like chapter 2 and 3 builds. But here, um, if you want to encounter this cool fight or the rare, you're going to go for a Morgulus. Like the one from Lionel Castle isn't really cool. So in this one, we can encounter a tier 3 cat, the vampire cat, and a male archer. And also some mind flares, like they're really deadly because of, again, cast that Berserk and Confuse. And the Vampire Cat, you know, has Blaster, which can petrify or stop, which is very deadly. So at this point in the game, for the most part, um, most people aren't going to have, like, you know, things like Ribbon or an accessory to protect them from negative status ailments. So I, I find these fights, they can be pretty hard. But if you have good RNG, like... Um, like they won't land on you so it's pretty cool so just for safety i'm just gonna play a little more passively um increase my speed and see if divine ruination can land on these two so that's going to put the vampire cat in critical which is really good for me and it gets rid of uh that uh Squid guy, the Pisco Demon, Demon, Disco Demon, Disco Inferno <laughs> Demon. And yeah, they're not going to attack that cat since um, it's in critical. And oh man, that claw for 120. Dude, that's good damage. Um, no counter from that Mind Flare, but that Mind Flare is just one hit away from being KO'd. The goblins are weak to ice, so that's good. And I just try and, you know, use more Tailwind. I don't want to get confused, especially. Because I, I hate the way that status looks, man. The one where, like, they're just moving their arms up and stuff. Oh my goodness, like... Like, getting confused for the first time ever playing this game, I'm just like, oh my goodness, come on. I try to go for a Divine Ruination here, see who I can hit. And this one's beautiful. This one's gonna hit four. Oh man. One of the most epic, especially when you can hit like three or more targets. Um, blocked from Joseph the Archer. And that Vampire Cat is just gonna move back and finish off the Goblin. Wow. See, look, look at the power of the uh, tier 3 monster. And that uh, spin, spinning back fist of doom did nothing. So hopefully Mind Blast doesn't. Oh, thank God. No Berserk Confused. So this battle is going to be ours pretty much. I'm going to have Ramza take care of this goblin for 598. Actually, I go after the cat first. That's who I'm a little more afraid of. Um, because, you know, blaster. And it will do more damage than a black album. So, let's see. Darn, can I not KO this Mind Flare? Alright. Hopefully. His Mind Blast won't... Ouch, 40. Um, oh man, Shida Hadori. Hopefully the Mind Blast won't affect these 48% chance. Come on, don't land. Oh, and we're good, man. Oh, today is the day for lottery tickets. Like, today is the day. Um, you know, I apply for <laughs> the job that pays me a lot more. But... Um, it's just tactics, you know, um, one of the things 
it's like man i have so much fun doing this you know um making tactics videos um the people in the comments uh, the vast majority sometimes it can be a little annoying but oh man i i love it um not the most money um we'll see where this goes but i'm just having a blast and the community has been so amazing and the judgment blade is here and this battle's a wrap so these are the rare and cool encounters on valley of swale um if you want to encounter them the first one go from the gallows this one from Morgulus. And thanks again so much for watching, and I'll see you next time with more FFT videos. Take care.